TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach hold hands while out on a date in New York City. On Friday, July 21st, Amy Robach and TJ, Holmes spent a romantic summer evening in New York City. According to images obtained by the U.S. Sun, the couple could be seen holding hands as they entered a number of bars. Black slacks, a matching bag, block heels, and a patchwork tube top were all worn by 50-year-old Robach. In contrast, Holmes, 45, appeared relaxed in a white t-shirt, gray slim fit pants, and boat shoes. Prior to visiting Gray Bar in Manhattan's nomad neighborhood in Midtown, the couple dined at the Italian restaurant Morandi and the Gastropub Due West in the West Village. One day before to their alleged Friday adventure, they were apparently captured on camera in a New York City real estate agency. Despite being married to different people, images of Robach and Holmes getting close outside of the office caused their relationship to become public for the first time in November 2022. In the midst of the scandal, the newscasters left GMA3, but their romance continued. After more than 10 years of marriage, Holmes filed for divorce from Marilee Feebig, with whom he shares a 10-year-old daughter named Sabine. In January, Feebig finally spoke out about the Holmes' public cheating incident. Marilee's lawyer, Stephanie Lehman, said in a statement to Us Weekly at the time that her client's single focus had been on her daughter, age 9, overall. During the holiday season and in light of the challenging times, Marilee's sole focus has remained on the best interest of her nine-year-old daughter, the statement said. To that end, TJ, S. Attorney and I have been collaborating to forward their divorce as swiftly, confidentially, and amicably as possible. However, we remain dismayed by TJ's lack of tact, deference, and consideration for Marilee and the daughter of the party, the attorney stated. Marilee has been moved by the outpouring of love and support and is eager for a fresh start in this new year. Robach and Andrew Shu, who got married in 2010, have stayed mum regarding the state of their union. However, a source exclusively revealed to us in April that the couple was secretly dividing their assets through mediation. Although Shu and Robach were not parents, they were stepparents to each other's children from prior relationships. Robach and ex-husband Tim McIntosh are parents to daughters Ava and Annalise, while Shu and ex-wife Jennifer Hagee are parents to sons Nate, Aiden, and Wyatt. We all felt it's best for everyone if they move on from ABC News following multiple fruitful meetings with Amy Robach and TJ. Holmes about various choices, ABC said in a statement several weeks after us initially broke the news. We appreciate their contributions and honor their talent and dedication over the years. While they look for their next work, the two have been enjoying their downtime. An insider exclusively revealed to us in April that they're pitching themselves as a duo. They have proposed a reality show, a docuseries, and a daytime discussion show, all of which they are confident will be well-liked and garner large audiences. Whatever they decide, Amy has emphasized they are all in this together because this is about real love.